how is that even possible guys <laughs> right like today i just woke up to this announcement that uh veo3 is now available to pro users and uh so i was like this is incredible because i've been trying i've been waiting to try out veo3 i've tried veo2 i was on the beta testing program so that we were able to get three months free as beta testers but it finally it's finally finally here and i was able to put those scenes together using flow and but it's it's wild like the way they're able to take information like the, just from a prompt so here i'll show you about the hand so this is what I was able to generate. And you can see some of the prompts that I was able to use. A lion stumbles to its feet and takes off running. So this is like a bunch of uh, like prompts, simple prompts put together. And then VEO is able to take it. So it has several models here. So there's text to video and then you have frames to video. Ingredients to video, you have to upgrade, you know, to be able to get to that level, to be able to use that. And with ingredients, you're able to use, like, give it like three images of uh, like maybe a chair, a cup, and a, uh, like a, a lady. And then it's able to create videos out of that, right? But in order to get that, you have to upgrade to Ultra, Google uh, AI Ultra, which is about $250, I think, per month. So I'm not yet sure what this means at $124.99 for three months. It, does that mean that I have to pay? A total of one twenty or one twenty five dollars for those three months or per month. So I am a little bit on the fence. But anyway, I had some credits in here, so I was like, let me do a test and see how this is gonna work out. And what you've just had is exactly the result of what I was I was able to do. And I also did this one prompt right here, and you can see how these buffaloes are running through. But it's able to generate the water, and it's like the buffalo jump into a river and cross it. So you can tell it at what point to the buffalo can jump into the water, right? So this was the first part. And then it's funny. So it's the, I like this better because you can see the outcropping of the, the river. This one, not so much because it's there's no demarcation. But this one is better because now I can see them. <laughs> and it even added the guys. So the idea was to see like this stampede with the Porsches chasing after this buffalo. So th this is wild that a system is able to take this and generate this kind of uh, footage together with uh, sound effects is wild to me. So let me know what you think, guys. Like, do you like it? And I mean, you can see some issues here every now and then. So it's not yet perfect. But seeing where this is headed is, is mind-blowing. That we're going get, to get to a point where all you need is a description of a scene and be able to feed it to your own prompts. For So here's what I was looking for. The ability for us to be able to upload our own images. So with frames to video, you can add two frames together and you're able to generate. And you can even add the camera angles in here and the camera you know transitions and all of that. they don't have handheld just yet and i think that is something that uh, probably you have to prompt but i'm sure they will add that but to be able to add those two and then be able to add the camera movement and then you're able to get a result like that right but this so i wish they could combine these three so that you can still do all of these in one set but ingredients to video is probably the better one but it's more expensive but anyway guys that's it this was my first real test of uh, veo3 and let me know what you think. You know, if you think this is worth, is it worth it to pay $250 a month to generate this type of content? Or do you prefer being able to create your own content? But think, uh, and, and also balance that with, look at the results that you're able to get, right? So anyways, I'm going to continue testing. <laughs> I'm still hesitant to bite into like, I need to be sure that this is not, this is 124 discount for like three months not per month because if it is per month then that's expensive <laughs> i would have to cancel every other subscription of every other probably ai platform that i've been testing to see if it's even worth it but let me know what you guys think you know this is incredible to be at this stage of uh you know create creativity i, I don't know if you call it creativity more like uh instructing a system to create because you really are not creating this 
we are not creating this. The system is creating this. You're more like an, a director telling, you know, the system, this is what I want done, you know? So it's going to be interesting. Maybe all of us are going to be down the road, just simple art directors, but not really artists because the system is creating that now. I think the need is to be able to control this, being able to like tell the path, tell it a path, or maybe draw a path where you want this buffalo to go, you know, like maybe a top-down kind of map, and then you're able to direct that kind of shot. Because yeah, you really are waiting to see what the prompt is going to look like, and you have no control whatsoever. You know, you can't, it's not like being over the shoulder of an artist and tell them, change the camera angle, change before you render, you know? <laughs> so anyway, this is my test. Let me know what you think. But it's in that, it's wild. I mean, seriously wild. All right. Thank you so much for joining me, guys. Please do spare a minute to subscribe and hit that notification bell. So you're alerted when I post a new video. And thank you to all my patrons out there. I'm going to continue to do my best to share any techniques that I find and share. If I find a workaround, even harnessing these systems, these platforms to be able to tell our stories. I'm, I'm really curious to see where this is headed and how we can be able to harness it. It's not going away. I think this is the worst it's going to ever be. It's going to only get better. Anyway, stay blessed. Much love each and every one of you. I'm praying for you and your families. Bye for now.